first. Um, I want to rule the world. Uh, but I became a PE teacher, so same thing. Yeah. So when I was a kid, I wanted to be a footballer. Okay. Premier, Premier League footballer. Right. Or, you know, the Cowboys? That's not really what we've been fans to be, but um, a footballer. Um, first thing I wanted to be was a footballer. Uh, so I did that for a little while, but when I was about 13 years old, I realised that was never going to happen. Um, then I wanted to be an author because I used to write a lot of short stories. And then I realised that actually, if I put together the football and the writing, a sports journalist was the perfect solution. Football agent. Football agent, that's what I want to be. I knew I was never good enough to be a footballer, but I want to be a football agent. Uh, I wanted to be Cleopatra. <laughs> Not that. Now I work with apprentices. Okay, so are you enjoying what you're doing now? Um, yeah, yeah. It's like, it's, to be fair, it's like the career I wanted to go into. Something I really enjoy. I'm really uh, enthusiastic about. So yeah, I really enjoy it. So do you think your like dreams and aspirations changed over time, or do they stay the same? And to be fair, not too long ago, I looked at my record of achievement, um, and when I was 16. My ambition was to be a PT, it's mental. I'm, I'm 37 now, and it's still the same. Like now, I work with special needs, which has changed slightly, yeah. So now I work, uh, I work for Tech North. Um, I work essentially helping digital businesses in the North grow and, and prosper. Okay, so um, what do you do now then? I'm a business technology journalist. So I was a sports journalist for about eight years. I then worked for the Daily Mirror, uh, doing a lot of news stuff and some sports stuff. Uh, now I'm in technology because that's where it's at. What are you doing now? Uh, sports marketing. So kind of similar then? Not far off, yeah. Never made it, but I'm nearly there. What changed? Uh, probably a bit more realistic. I think uh, external factors probably played a role, but uh, I was realistic. Like what? Like what? Uh, just the way in which the industry's mo moved and changed, I guess. Um, it wasn't something I guess it was very easy to get into. And uh, I enjoyed marketing at uni and the changed my mind a little bit. And you're loving what you're doing now? Yeah, absolutely. Love what it. advice you got to other people that want to follow their dreams? Just do it. You may have to wait a while, you can't have what you want straight away, always, but just, just go for it. Keep the dream alive. Don't give up. So what do you think's changed? Did your aspirations change? Did you become more realistic or what what made the difference? Or did you think uh... making is it for me? No, I still do that. I still do it, but I pursue that for fun. So I do that at home, and I cook at home, and I cook for my family. I spend a lot of time doing that for fun. Um, and then do this, which I think is maybe even more rewarding. You get to help young people, and, and that, that feels really good. So you're living two passions at the moment? Yeah.